Did you know these five things about intestinal worms? 1. Intestinal worms, also called soil transmitted helmets, are one of the most common infections worldwide. They affect the poorest and most marginalized communities. Intestinal worms are spread by eggs in human feces, which contaminate the soil in areas where sanitation and hygiene is poor. Contaminated soil may be found on unwashed vegetables, hands, or in contaminated water. If someone ingests the soil particles, they can become infected. 2. Adult worms live in a person's intestine. They can range from less than a millimeter to more than a meter long. At first, symptoms can be mild, but they can lead to nutritional problems can affect cognitive and physical development. In severe cases, it can be fatal. There are three major types of soil transmitted helmets that are treated by deworming programs. Ascaris lumbricoides, whipworm, and hookworm. They can lay up to a thousand eggs a day in the intestine. Three. Intestinal worms have affected humans since medieval times. They are no longer widespread in Europe, but traces of intestinal worm eggs have been found in ancient European societies. This shows that rates of infection in the European medieval ages were similar to what they are in at-risk communities today. 4. Preschool and school age children and women of reproductive age are at highest risk of infection. The worms can decrease people's quality of life, affecting their employment, education, fertility, and happiness. Children may be forced to miss school, damaging their learning and development. 5. Specially trained teachers are key to controlling intestinal worms. Thanks to community and school programs, intestinal worms can be treated with a single dose of deworming medication. These vital treatments are often distributed in schools by teachers who also promote the importance of hand washing and good hygiene to prevent infection. Communities are now fighting back against intestinal worms. Within our lifetime, it may be possible to control the disease. Thanks to the support of communities, governments, donors, and a network of partners, more people than ever are being treated for intestinal worms. But there is still work to be done. More funding and support is needed to reach everyone at risk and to rid the world of this painful disease. Find out more www.sitesavers.org forward slash mtds.